Hi, um, my name is Dream Heideman, and I'm a sophomore at Lincoln High School. You know! And this is Heartbeat. My parents warned me about drugs in the streets, but never the ones with big brown eyes and a heartbeat. He's a type of boy who has the power to take your heart and shatter it into a million pieces and take every organ from your body and empty your veins onto the bathroom floor. But God, if you ever get the chance to be held, I swear you will never feel more full. I know he's not the one I'm looking for, but I'm so cold. And a fire is a fire. It only took two minutes to get my attention by sending two paragraphs explaining to me all of the things I thought so abnormal about myself and illuminate them to a blinding light that kind without a lampshade so when you turn it on, you can't even look at it, but now you see the room. It was a piece of art, a Greek statue, pale and stone-faced from the chin up. You'd think his touch would be too stiff and clammy, but God was his touch sweet. And with every word, amorous with every syllable, every noun, intricate and smooth, to every stranger, he was amiable, and with me, he was amazed. Looking at me, he'd say, you're perfect. And in that moment, I was a walking paradox, wondering where he came from and how someone can be so passionate about another person they hardly even know. It was something out of a James Cameron movie, and I was the lucky one, while he was the helpless thoughts boy who wanted so much but needed so little. His raped hands and scarred body made me question if my life was ever difficult, made me wonder about my repetitive sadness. One look into his eyes, and I felt everything as if he were wearing his burdens as a pair of lenses that never come off. When I looked at him, that's all I saw. A boy beaten to the grave before he had the chance to live, he'd say. Now my mind is in a pocket of emotion, a place where no mind belongs. Now I'm insensible, insecure, and unconscious. I took care of you while you were sick. I gave you food I didn't have. I gave you clothes I really needed. I let you in. I let you leave. I let you take the keys and car with it because I'm insensible, insecure, and insane. Because the lenses you always wear put emotions in my brain. Now it's my fault your life has taken a turn for the worse. All you had to do was put the car in reverse. Now it's my fault that your life has taken a... <laughs> Now you're in a cell, now those ugly, le ugly le lenses can lend their waves onto someone else. Leave me be, I'm comfortably numb, comfortably pleased. Leave me be, you sociopathic being. Now you can say you love me and I won't feel a thing. My parents warned me about heartbeats. They said, remember to look for one.